overstuffed trash cans, trash bags, and other household garbage piled in front of people's homes and in back alleys. It's a sign of the times in New Orleans. The city shifted to once-a-week trash pickup in early October after the two primary solid waste contractors, Metro Service Group and Richard's Disposal, fell behind on their routes. The reason that we moved from twice a week to once a week is because twice a week wasn't working. It wasn't happening. It wasn't reliable. It, it just wasn't working. The city is now reaching out to industry experts for ideas on how to get the best sanitation services for residents. That information will be used to hopefully improve the collection process as the city rebids Metro's current contract. Sydney Torres owns Ivy Waste, one of the city's emergency waste contractors brought on in an effort to catch up on garbage removal. He says if the city returns to twice a week pickup, look for higher sanitation fees. There's no way you can pick it up under the current conditions for the same pricing. Uh, it's just not possible in the way that it is right now. It's just the, the materials and, and equipment and labor, everything has gone up. The city sanitation fee was suspended for November. New Orleans Communications Director Bo Tidwell says it will return to $24 a month in December. People will continue to pay the twice a week cost for once a week pickup. The number is not really what's in play here. The services, right? The pickups are happening. They're happening in a more reliable way than they were happening three months ago. According to the city, recycling will restart in the areas serviced by Richard's disposal by the end of the year. It won't resume in areas serviced by Metro until a new contract is bid in the first quarter of next year. Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News.